Hey guys, it's Allie, and today I will be showing you how to get this fall smoky eye look. And stay tuned till the end of the video for a really cool giveaway. Okay, so you're gonna start with your face makeup already done for this look, so that's what I did. And I'm gonna start with MAC Prep and Prime Eyeshadow Primer, and I'm just gonna put this on my lids and then underneath my eyes as well, because I feel like it really, really makes the eyeshadow stay. Especially with the smoky eye look, it's important to do this. Yeah. Then we're gonna go into eyebrows, and this is an awesome palette from Coastal Scents that I got totally obsessed with. And you're just gonna use an angled brush and start by outlining the top and the bottom of your eyebrows, and then just start slowly filling it in until it's the color you desire. Then when you get to the middle part, I personally like to do a little line up and down ways um, to kind of make it a more defined end of the eyebrow. Yeah. <laughs> then we're gonna use a brush like this. And this awesome color from L'Oreal, I'll put that in the description. And you're just gonna put it all over your lid and in your crease until it is the color that you like. I did a few coats. And then put a little bit underneath the eye as well just to blend it and give it that nice, rich, smoky look. Naked 2 palette, we're gonna use the color Half Baked, which is that gold. And you're just gonna put it right down the center of your eye to give it a little bit more dimension and have it pop a little more. Then use the brush from the Naked 2 palette and you're gonna use the color Snake Bite, and you're gonna start working it in from the outer corners of the eye and a little bit into the crease. Then you're gonna use the other side of that brush and wet the brush and dip it in Snake Bite again, and then line the bottom and then the top of your eyelids. Then get rid of any leftover stray eyeshadow and use this awesome, awesome, awesome eye illuminator called Stroke of Light. Totally obsessed with this, and then you're just gonna blend that in. Then use Revlon Color Stay Eyeliner and you're gonna line the upper water line of your eye. <laughs> and then a little bit on the actual top of the eye as well. Then curling your lashes. Okay, so I'm gonna just curl my lashes normally. And then I'm gonna start with Scandalize from Rimmel. I totally have been loving this mascara. It separates your lashes really, really nice. And then top with another coat of Falsies Mascara. Then you're gonna push them up. I did this weird trick thing. I don't know, it helps them be curlier and I like it. And then one more coat of the Falsies Mascara. And then the same on your bottom lashes. <laughs> and your eyes are done, woo! <laughs> Then you just take off this headband, and we're gonna use my favorite, favorite lip, <laughs> lip gloss, whoa. Um, it's from Bare Minerals, and it's in the color Rebel. So if you guys like the neon dress I was wearing in my cover of Shake It Off by Taylor Swift, which is right here if you forgot what it looked like or haven't seen it yet, I will be giving away the exact same dress from my friends at Oasap. It is so comfortable, I had so much fun dancing in it all day, and I got so many compliments on it, so I really love the dress. The one I will be giving away is a size large, but it fits like a size medium in my opinion, just so you know if it'll fit you or not. What you have to do to win. Number one, you must be following me on Twitter and subscribe to me on YouTube. Number Number two, you must tweet my cover of Shake It Off to Taylor Swift at Taylor Swift 13 and mention me at Ali Brostovsky with the hashtag Shake It Off Ali. And I will be picking my favorite tweet, a random tweet that has all of those things in it. I'll be looking at them throughout the week and in next week's Tuesday video I will announce the winner and then we'll be in contact with you and we'll get your address and stuff. I'll be sending you the dress along with a signed picture and a cute little personal note from me too you. So yeah, it's really simple and I'm really excited about this. I feel like it'll be a lot of fun to see what you guys do to make your little tweets creative and fun and all that. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll talk to you soon. Bye! These socks are also from American Apparel. I love the little lace detail on them and doing their dances in them, apparently. Uh, these sunglasses are also from OASAP. And these shoes are from there as well. I love the floral detail on them and that they have a little bit of a platform, so yeah.